Hello everybody and welcome back to the Payless Movement. Today we will talk about an awesome topic. It is about automatic digital note taking and it is actually working. You might have seen already these things that take automatic meeting notes, but we tested all the different AI note taking tools and we settled on one specific one. It's called Meet Geek and we really love it compared to the other summaries because in all the other note takers it made so many times no sense and I wasn't able to jump into the parts inside the video and so on. I will show you how Meet Geek works with actually real case scenarios because we are using it on a daily basis in every meeting that we have. And then I show you how I integrated MeetGeek with MEM using Sapia in order to feed my personal knowledge management system with all the meeting minutes that we had. So I can ask them later on, MEM, about anything about any meeting and it will find the relevant meeting. This is really amazing stuff. So let's dive into this. Paperless movement, your productivity, your way. We are already inside MeetGeek and what you see here is a recording that was done by MeetGeek during our call with ClickUp. We are in the ClickUp 3.0 beta group and I'm one of the tool advisors where we meet up with the developers directly to give feedback how they can further improve the tool. So really excited to be part of this whole journey. And here you see a great example, right? It, it recognizes that I had a lot of concerns, right? So it shows the points where I really was pointing out the things that can improve. And then it also recognized tasks where I suggested to make things in order to make this better. And what you can do with this summary. I can click here and play summary. The whole recording, however, is 30 minutes. So this is awesome. I could now watch in seven minutes all the key takeaways that happen. When I click here, it will jump to the different parts of the summary. This is amazing. I can also click here. You see it scrolls directly to the part in the video. And then I can just click here and it will oh, jump. It's still not implemented. I, I thought we did this. And then I can click here. It scrolls there and I and it scrolls there and I can directly start playing this from here, but I also can just get the link to this. And now I can share this link with anybody else in order to like Loom videos. I could now share exactly this part. So it will only show this part. So let's do this quickly. Going in incognito, pasting this URL. And now you see it opens up this and you see this is only the part out of this video where we talk about this specific topic. And the great thing is, if you're on a pro plan and meet geek, you can make this branded so it looks like your company. And then we can share these anywhere out of the meetings. This is amazing. The other thing is great that I can quickly go here and search for anything in there. So I could say task and it goes to anything that we mentioned task. The great thing now is that it doesn't end here. I can share this now on Google Drive. I can send this via email. I can download the videos. And in order to get in the videos, you don't need to have a direct Zoom integration. You can manually upload videos in order to get the context out there as well. One more thing that I want to show you is that I can go to here, which is the minutes. So that's the real summary out of this. The insights, it shows you the call sentiment and silence rate and on time and so on. I can take notes about this meeting and I see the agenda that is out of the, the Google Calendar link. So it works by integrating with Google Calendar as soon as it recognizes a Zoom or Google Meet or I think Outlook Teams conference call. It will join this call automatically and it will start taking the notes for you. Now an amazing thing. I go to Mem and now let's ask Mem about this conversation. And there we go. It finds already this stuff. It starts writing out. And what happens here is that as soon a summary appears in MeetGeek, I use Sapia to pick this up and send it into Mem. And here you see there is the meeting minutes, attendees. So you see here is a summary already out of this Mem. But I can now go to this map. I can go to the map and you see here is exactly the meeting minutes that we had before. And I can click here and click there and it will go directly to the meeting that we just had there. I think this is amazing because now it's in my personal knowledge base and I can ask the chatbot that is leveraging the context in my personal knowledge base in order to find information that I would have lost guaranteed two months later after the meeting already. After using MeetGeek for months already and deeply integrating it in our own workflows, we decided that MeetGeek becomes a verified partner of the Payless movement. This means that we now have a deep dive 
into Meet Geek in our Payless Movement membership that you can watch and learn everything about how to set up Meet Geek, how to use it in different use cases. And we also have a special discount for our members that you will find in our discount section where you get three months of Meet Geek with 30% off. So if you're a member, make sure to check this out. If you think this is useful, let us know in the comments below. If you have other setups, share it with us as well. And if you haven't already, subscribe to this YouTube channel so I can catch you up next time.